Hey guys, a little bit of an interesting video here today. I just turned 29 years old today and I thought I would share a little bit of this this little wisdom nugget, this little story to you guys for any of you who ever have a bad day or going through a bit of a rough time. Obviously after my second diagnosis and the surgery thing, my mind was in a whole heap of random emotions and anxieties and different feelings and whatnot. Uh, considering it being the second time, to a point where I was kind of wondering if I was going through like an anxiety slash depressive attack. I was going for a walk in Langley one day just to clear my head and I was like, okay, let's see, what's one way to test if I'm really going through a, like this kind of, this unfortunate feeling. So I decided to walk into the Cascades Casino, which is was right next to me for some reason. And the reason why I thought this is because I don't like casinos too much. I don't know, the whole atmosphere just doesn't make me feel good. I, I get high anxiety with a bunch of people being around and all that sort of stuff. So as I was walking through it, I was having a little bit. I wasn't feeling the, the greatest mentally. And then as I was leaving, I saw a gentleman fall down. This older gentleman, I saw, maybe say late 60s. He's definitely one of those typical stereotype, go and play the slots kind of guy. I th saw him fall down outside uh, around one of these pillars. I was coming through the doors on the other side and I noticed him and I could see he was getting up again. I was like, oh, that's good. Now this is the point I should also say too, if you don't like stories about this, I can understand if you don't watch the rest of this video, but if you do, the reward of it is going to help you. I saw something come out and down this guy's leg. And I was like, oh, is that what I think it is? And he went around the pillar and then I could see him standing. The dude had totally shat himself. Mud butt. He thankfully had gray shorts, so it just looked like... <laughs> it just looked like a water balloon had exploded on his back, but I could see it going down his legs. But the thing was, this dude just kept on walking. He did not stop. And what was even more interesting, it looked like nothing had happened. He just kept on walking. Some people kind of gave him like a side glance. People who were passing him from the front, you wouldn't have thought of anything else. This is the kind of the weird part. He was walking in the direction of where my car was parked. So I had to kind of follow him from afar. I wanted to ask him if he was okay, but I know that if I was in his situation, the last thing I would want is for someone to ask me how I'm doing right after I shat myself. But this guy was walking, admittedly a bit of a brisk step, but he was walking as though nothing had happened. And he, again, walking in the direction of my car, so I had to follow him. I think he's going to his car, but no, he's not. He's walking onto the sidewalk, he turns right, and he just keeps going. So when I got to my car, I stood and looked, and I watched him until he eventually got out of sight. And I thought, if that dude can full on shit himself, and walk it off like nothing happened, I ain't got any problems. If he can handle that, I can handle my problems. And that has honestly been a huge, huge source of help, oddly enough, for me for the last few months in terms of my anxiety and just my, my depressive matter. I kind of have this more mentality now, if there's an opportunity, I'm gonna take it. I'm uh, going to try something new. Obviously, I've ate, I've changed how my diet is. I, for those of you who watched me about four months ago, you'll notice I've I've lost some weight. Um, I lost about 30 pounds so far, which is pretty cool. I never expected to have a thin head again. Hell, I'm, I'm as thin as I was when I was in high school. That's just my fruit of thought for you guys. If you ever feel like you're having a bad day, if you're having a hard time, and if you feel like the world's up against you, just think of this dude. Mind you, I don't know if he actually had a little bit of a, a dementia moment in that moment too, because he did fall. I don't, hope, don't think he hit his head, but that could have been the other reason why he walked that off as though it was nothing. But either way, that's just my little story for you guys. That's my little tidbit of advice and uh, kind of a little update about myself as well for those of you who do know me and those of you who are just new to this channel. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed this little video, this little random note. Uh, it's kind of an odd little thing for myself, but I thought that, you know, if there was a good day to talk about this would be my birthday. Hope you all doing well, hope you guys are okay, and I hope you guys are doing well with your days, your problems, and your challenges. Anyways guys, I hope you liked the video. If you did, leave a like, and if you're interested in more, maybe subscribe. Otherwise, I'll see you guys next time.